What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. We're the Octobers, and it's my choice today to pick out the movie, and today I choose 50 First Dates. I got to pick the movie today, guys, because we just finished Game of Thrones, and it was an emotional roller coaster. Such a roller coaster, man. <laughs> and real. I'm honestly so sad it's finished, so I wanted to do something lighthearted and fun, and honestly romantic as well. I've never seen this movie. She told me to wear my Hawaiian shirt. Apparently, it takes place in Hawaii, and I'm really excited to watch it. Adam I'm Sandler, so excited. we saw him in The Water Boy. He was hilarious mm -hmm. in that. I don't really know what happened, man. We watched that movie. We had a really good time with it, and then we just never watched another Adam Sandler no, movie. So we're back at it again. And then, since she's picking this movie, I get the next pick. And the movie that I've seen that I want her to watch is The Truman Show. So we're going to be tuning into that. So hopefully, you guys like that movie, and we'll be knocking that one out soon. So like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, like always. You ready, Mom? I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go. If I remember one thing about this movie, y'all, it has a great soundtrack if i remember correctly alcohol use sexual content violence foul language what are you showing me over here <laughs> well i really haven't seen this in 10 years though i'm just joking but i have seen it a lot in the 10 years that i haven't seen it it's that been that sense. long 10 years yeah i haven't seen it in 10 years so tell me how was hawaii it was a good good cover it was <laughs> unbelievable oh yeah well what happened this reminds me I of scream a little bit it was the best week of my life <laughs> it took me to all these cool local places oh. <laughs> we went scuba diving snorkeling <laughs> well we got a little drunk <clears throat> <laughs> When I asked for his phone number, he told me he's married. Gay. Entering the priesthood. He doesn't believe in phones. He just kind of ran away. Oh. <laughs> I will never forget my week with Henry Roth. Henry Roth. Harry Paratesticles. <laughs> Henry Roth. <laughs> Henry Roth. His shoulder that lady, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Where are we at? SeaWorld or something? Hey, I'm a person, not a seal, huh? Well, I am a vet, oh. not a doctor, so just hold still or I won't give you a treat. That guy's I in the hot know. chick, oh, I think. Man, you see that? Sharks are like dogs. They only bite when you touch the private parts. Oh, okay, I see, I see, <laughs> okay. I see. Is this the guy that you said worked as the uh, aquarium taker? Or that guy, okay. Oh, come on, I need some details. You get some boobies, some assy, a pull on your boy boy, come on. Daddy, what's a nympho? <laughs> oh, the nympho is the state bird of Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> You're the state idiot of Hawaii. <laughs> you know, one of these days, yeah. you're gonna show one of those tourists such a good time. <laughs> She's gonna stay on the island, bro. Now, why do you say such mean things to me like that? And why is your foot on my pillow? <laughs> <laughs> so so dirty. Dirty. Get up, get up. <laughs> it could happen. Mm -hmm. Then you won't be able to go on your big boat trip to Alaska. You'll be stuck here, waking up next to the same old, ugly broad, just like Ula. <laughs> <laughs> Who's Ula? Other mom. <laughs> no, him. He's Ula. <laughs> oh. Come quickly, it's Joko. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Did you know that was about to happen? <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Come on, Jocko. This is why I got into this business. Is it? To save sea animals. <laughs> Go wash yourself off, okay? Maybe try some turpentine. That might take the stink away. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, high five is right, buddy. I knew you were gonna burp, but the vomit thing was awesome. That's what she gets for eating my roast beef sandwich. Willie, did you hey, see that? <laughs> Maybe that's why I love this movie because there's so many animals in it. This is cool because I'm loving all the like, you know, the seawater and the animals. This is great. It's just good vibes. It's a happy place to be. <laughs> It was like a shrimp boat captain. On <laughs> I've taken the sea serpent for a trip around the island of Oahu, whose unspoiled walrus habitat. Was <laughs> that was almost his life. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> That'd still be fun. I'd still love to have that. That's a cool spot, though. Amazing. Oh, time for a lunch. I want to eat there so bad. If you guys ate there, comment below. <laughs> I feel like I'd get a big crab sandwich or something. No, you got to get some spam. What did you eat? I had a Reese's peanut butter cup and some Gatorade. <laughs> yeah, not breakfast. I get you spam and eggs. <laughs> Nick, I need spam oh. and eggs. <laughs> no, it's a Hawaiian thing, spam and eggs. Hey, you want for me to put peanut butter cups in your eggs? No, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> peanut butter cups. <laughs> He's trolling him, Loki. That was so funny. What are you doing in this situation? <laughs> oh, okay, here we go. Casey from Scream. Hey, Sue, nice haircut. Mahalo, Lucy. <laughs> <laughs> what is she doing? Some architecture, okay? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she making like a teepee or a volcano or something. The Hawaiian volcano. <laughs> 
Are you staring at me or her? Because you're starting to freak me out. <laughs> Settle down and eat your pancakes, huh? But man, oh man, was she cute though. I thought you like your bitches from out of state. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure I don't get tied down. Freeze that image right there. <laughs> There's a little fella. Congratulations, mommy. Oh. I am grouchy due to lack of recent physical intimacy. Ooh. Shut up, because here comes one time only opportunity. What I will do now is go into your office and become near. <laughs> Next move is up to you. I may not be as limber as I once was, but I make up for it with enthusiasm and willingness to experiment. <laughs> I don't know if you realize I'm not into guys. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you cracking up. You never laugh this hard. <laughs> Why don't you fry some up and throw some eggs on top of it for me? You got it. All right, Mahalo. Hey, hey, let's go. Hi, Nick. Not him, that guy. His name's Henry Roth. <laughs> <laughs> she, she got some Lincoln Log pancakes. I know, what the heck. Why don't you try this? It's kind of a hinge. Touching up in her paintings. Now, why didn't I think of that? Yes, I'm Henry Roth. Nice, nice to meet you. Meet you. Is it yes? <laughs> Pretty. Keep up the good work. Wait, I see you're sitting there alone. Um, do you want to come and sit down? Sure, sure. That'd be great. Oh, you hear that song in the background? So, are you an architect? Oh. I am not. I'm in fish. Oh, that's where the smell is coming from. <laughs> I love that smell. <laughs> Why? I like that smell. No, I do. My dad's a fisherman. <laughs> he and my brother Doug, they go out to sea for months at a time. When they come back, I, I just hold on to them for five minutes each. Ten minutes. <laughs> That's ten minutes of holding somebody. And they smell just like your hands. The best smell in the world. Oh. Well, my fingers are available for your sniffing pleasure anytime you need them. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> 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 so dang, he just found love, huh? Walruses are known for their... Uh, tusks. Their tusks. Uh, also, their male parts can get pretty gigantic. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's the second biggest out of all the mammals. What's the first? Uh, I think tattoo face. <laughs> <laughs> he got caught slipping, cutting Vam in the middle like of the can. That was funny because he was supposed to say me, but <laughs> that wouldn't have been funny. Oh, oh okay, sorry, Sue. And the real cool. I love that spot. They're very mysterious. I'm, I have to go. Uh, where are you going? It's my dad's birthday, and we go every year and we pick a pineapple. It's a tradition. Sounds oh. nice. <laughs> Take care. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> he said, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't with this guy. <laughs> Yeah, he's funny, man. That is the stupidest looking swing I've ever seen. <laughs> you want her number? You pimping tourists for me again, Ula? Yes. I live vicariously through you, remember? <laughs> Give her the white kiki sneaky between the cheeky. <laughs> oh. White kiki sneaky. <laughs> this way I can imagine I did it, and then I can get through another weekend. I'm staying there. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you, though. What? Hey, Dad. Not now, Kino Makakakakoa. <laughs> Where your stitches are be? Oh. <laughs> Must have been my huge back swing. Hale, you think you can stitch me up again tonight after I get back from surfing? Yeah, looking forward to it. I after he gets back from surfing? Like that. You might attract a shark or something. What's wrong with that, cuz? Sharks are naturally peaceful. Is that right? <laughs> How'd you get that nasty cut anyway? A shark bit me. Nice. <laughs> we'll smoke another one, bro. I'll tell you, that shark theory is starting to catch on. <laughs> Say shit now! Bro, he went to go get it. No <laughs> I don't way. know why. Is he is not playing it up that hill. Looking for something? <laughs> oh, yeah. Is he thirsty or something? <laughs> oh, my God. What are you doing here? Same thing you are, looking for my ball. <laughs> Can't wait to have breakfast with you again tomorrow. I know, and I just want to eat you up. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. Tomorrow, <laughs> and the next day, <laughs> is that and really? the next day, okay. and the next Whoa. day. Oh. Oh my. Oh, Lucy, I feel so good. <laughs> no, my nipples are too sensitive. Stop that. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Your ball hooked into that cart, bounced back, and then hit you in the head. It was freaking hilarious. <laughs> And what's up with your nipple? <laughs> <laughs> this way you got hit. Ah, yes! Whoa, whoa. So There's just something about Lucy, huh? Has <laughs> nice to give up that double agent yeah, lifestyle. Well, it's a little. Well, look, he's back at it. I'd like to do something extra fun tonight. <laughs> <laughs> he said, uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> mm -mm. 
Mm. Wow, taking it deep, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, Albert, how about another fishbowl for a young lady? Why don't I just tap a keg for her? Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm Dang, getting really drunk. Are you getting drunk? It's getting there. So, what are you thinking? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I'm not drunk at all, Noreen, and neither are you, because there's no alcohol in these drinks. Sadly, I've used this technique many times to stay awake all night and have guilt-free, vigorous sex with me. <laughs> wow. I'm sorry. She already knows that. I'm not cliff diver either. I'm afraid of heights. Well, since it's my last night in town, can I pretend you didn't just say that and still have sex with you anyway? I can't do it. Well, can you at least point me in the direction of someone who can? Uh, <laughs> that guy over there could help you out. <laughs> Isn't that a woman? Jeez, I'm not really sure. <laughs> but you're too drunk to notice, remember? Take care. <laughs> oh. What with the cat drug in? My cheeks are starting to hurt. <laughs> Why? Because you're laughing. So We've been laughing the whole movie. There she is. Goosey Lucy Lou. Hi. Hi. I was petting my walrus all morning and I was thinking about you the whole time. Okay, pervert. I think that you should leave. What? I'm just joking around because of what we talked about yesterday. Yesterday? I've never even met you. Lucy is a very special person, very different from other people. About a year ago, Lucy was in a terrible car accident. She and her father went up North Shore to get a pineapple. Oh, aren't that so adorable? <laughs> Oh, they hit that tree the right there. Some ribs, but Lucy suffered a serious head injury. She don't she remember. Lost her memory, her whole life, up to the night before the accident, she remembers. She just can't retain any new information. It, it's like her slate gets wiped clean every night while she sleeps. Hold on here. That's this crazy. This sounds like something I would tell a psycho girl so she would stop calling me. Am I the psycho girl? I wish I was making this up. She has. That's no what I was thinking at first. Like she was playing him back. Each morning she wakes up thinking it's October 13th of last year. She reads the newspaper though. It's a special paper her father puts on their porch every night. It's from the day of her accident. He got hundreds of them printed up. Oh wow. Lucy does the same thing every day. Uh -huh. Dang. Do you still want to date this girl after that? <clears throat> You that meet, might be the perfect girl for him. Babe, imagine you meet me, right? And then the next day, I don't remember anything. What's up? Hello. I would yeah. not even, like, probably Hi, dig into it because that oh, would scare hi. me. <laughs> you got one without me. Oh, well. Yeah, the same with me. That's wild. Party, you gave it to me. It's a birthday present. I don't hurt her feelings. I think she likes you. <laughs> yeah. Well, I have another idea. Paint me something nice for my birthday. I will. Mm. And promise that we can pick a pineapple for Thanksgiving, okay? Sounds great. He's like, hey, sure. You should watch the Vikings game while I'm painting. Good idea. Aww. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. Nice light. What are we doing? Bruh. I'm dead. Yeah, That's go. Sam right there. Try not to the sauce. Sorry, Pop. Jeez, I didn't realize he was so jacked. <laughs> <laughs> His hat's dope, though. He's like, we're Vikings. <laughs> we're getting fired. We're getting fired. Look, they turned hey, it on real quick. <laughs> hey, we have the painting coming. Sorry. You'll see. How about he fakes a hand off to Williams and throws a pass to Kleinsoff off in the end? <laughs> Luther does the dishes. You're on. Culpepper fakes a hand off to Williams. He will throw. He's got Kleinsaucer in the end zone. Touchdown! That poor girl oh, does dishes good. every night, don't she? Maybe you should be a coach. <laughs> <laughs> Moron. Happy, Happy birthday, dear dad. Aww. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. That's so sad. This is his birthday every day. I oh, know. That's why I just said all. Over 25. Yeah, right. And Doug's muscles aren't pharmaceutically enhanced. What are you talking about? I need an herb supplement that can be purchased at any health food store. Check this out. Check out these <laughs> Rock hard, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. You're going to make is me throw up on Isn't that cake. funny because it's okay. Sam? <laughs> Open your present. Mr. Frodo. <laughs> <laughs> That's the guy who jumped in the water to... <laughs> hey, when I'm done doing the dishes, do you guys want to watch it? <laughs> oh, we need to see it. Bruce Willis is a ghost. I'm just, I'm shocked. Did you see that coming? Not a clue. <laughs> anyway, it was awesome. Well, maybe it was spoiled for us, but we'll still watch it. Oh, Doug, I can barely wrap my arms around you. Check this out. <laughs> 
Okay, okay, okay. Okay, and now for the teddy dance. Play your sister go to sleep. I like it. Sweet dreams, Lisa. Night. She's just so pleasant. You know what I'm saying? She takes a morning batch you went to Aww. She kind of reminds me of you, like your personality. Just bubbly. Aww. She seems a little sweeter sometimes, though. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I guess they had to make it a little simpler because they didn't, they didn't want to have to drive out all the outfit. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that part might be a little too much. <laughs> <laughs> hey Tracy, how you doing? Yeah? <laughs> Things changed a little bit since high school. <laughs> Wasn't Tracy the name of Adam Sandler's girlfriend? <laughs> I don't even know, but <laughs> that's Sam. <laughs> <laughs> that's what you just have to remember. See, Sam is that guy to me. <laughs> so it's like <laughs> I thought he was the weird workout guy in this movie. <laughs> Dang, they have 365 layers of paint on that. And this is what happens Probably more. every single day. What you're saying is, this is the perfect girl for you. What do you mean? You can hang out with her all day with no attachment because her plane leaves every night. There's only one problem with that. What is? It's evil. Yeah, that's kind of gross. <laughs> you meet her, hang out, flirt, no commitment, nobody gets hurt. She's got brain damage, you psycho. Okay, I'll give you that one. <laughs> but I think it'd be healthy for you, Honolulu. Hey, you'd be doing exactly what her father does. Giving her a wonderful day. Then when it's time for you to go on your big boat trip, poof, you just leave. She never even know you're gone. See, I'm not sure about the poofing part <laughs> because I'm not a very good poofer. Could you demonstrate a good poof for me? Quit busting my coconuts for five seconds. <laughs> All right. Would you stop poofing on that joint and do some work? Okay, let's get the sucker ready. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. I, can, I don't like this song because my sister's name is Amber. Oh. <laughs> so I don't sing this. How is it? Lucy probably didn't want to talk to you anyway. Um, what does that mean? This ain't a disco. She doesn't want guys hitting on her while she has her breakfast. <laughs> she does if it's Henry Roth. <laughs> Who that? Who that? Why is that a disco? <laughs> I bet you 20 bucks I can get her to have breakfast with me again. You're wrong. I love it. <laughs> you should try this out. Put it in there. Swiggly door. <laughs> Wild mm. Williams can come in and out now. Oh, are you from a country where it's okay to stick your fingers all over someone else's food? <laughs> no, I'm from this country. Why were you gonna eat that? Oh, all right. Well, have a good meal. <laughs> Twenty bucks. Cha ching. <laughs> Dude, this movie is too much fun right now. What in the world? That was pathetic. Yeah, I want to get you up on your span. Hey, I'm sorry to bother you. I drew this. It's a uh, picture of a father and son <laughs> fishing off a fishing boat. There's a walrus, a walrus right there. Who, uh, Senti Fei Tong Tong. Huh? Don't speak English. <laughs> Kun Kai. Kai. <laughs> <laughs> they love it. <laughs> Can I have that? I need something to wipe my ass with. <laughs> 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 what is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what's the matter with him. Looks like a stupid asshole to me. <laughs> He's not sitting in the bar today, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Is this something that I could help you with? No, no, no. I just can't read. Oh, what? You're kidding. <laughs> Here, I can read the menu. Oh, no, 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 no. Dang, so he's allowed to I lie about himself like this? I thought that was outside of the rules. I need you. Pan. Pan. Pancakes. 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 Okay, I'll let pancakes. He's like Sir Davos. I'll tell you what, why don't you come over there with me? You can have some breakfast and I'll help teach you some of the words. Oh. Okay. All right. That sounds nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and C is that little half a squiggly one, right? <laughs> like if you're 37 and you can't read, then. How did you get so it's gonna good? be tough. It's <laughs> gonna be real care? tough. Okay, this <laughs> nice time. I'll see you around. Okay. Really? That's it? 
That's what. All that flirting and phony I can't read stuff, <laughs> and then you're not even going to ask me out or for my phone number? I can't read. Oh, shut up. That was one of the goofiest <laughs> things I've ever seen in my life. But I thought, hey, if this guy is so desperate to meet me, he might be worth talking to. <laughs> but then I get stiffed. I thought uh, she was so stylish when I first saw it. It's like Mahalo for the ego boost. <laughs> you're right. You're right. I can read a little. I didn't know I came before E. That one I didn't know. I swear. <laughs> that one kicks my butt too. I hope you're happy, Shamu. <laughs> oh, Shamu. <laughs> Martin, give us a break. Just stay away from the Hookie Lab Cafe. Okay, sorry. From their perspective, I get it though. Right. They really do go through a lot, and they try their best to protect her. I could have whooped his ass, Daddy, but uh, this gravel is <laughs> Yeah, well, maybe you need to do a few more butt flexes. Cheap thought, Dad. So <laughs> fresh and so clean. Hey, Alexa, did you ever hook up with butt, that girl Daddy. from the bar the other night? I chickened out. Really? Yeah, I don't know. I guess I prefer sausage to taco. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? Yeah, no, I agree, but no, I always guess said, bye. The hills. I don't want to hear that. <laughs> If I promised a woman's father I would not see her, mm -hmm. I would simply shut my eyes while she serves my manhood. Okay. <laughs> it's actually a cool way to look at it. In a very gross way. <laughs> <laughs> like, what the heck? <laughs> that bridge is sick, though. I like it. Grace on the water. I didn't know Seal had in more than one song. So when you seen this, you thought she was cool as hell, huh? Yeah. <laughs> He's not at the lounge, he said, bruh. Uh-oh, car trouble? Yeah. You mind giving me a jump? Appreciate your time. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you fell for that. <laughs> oh, my grandfather died trying to jumpstart a car. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I was just joking around. I can't believe you fell for that! Oh. <laughs> that was very good. My name's Henry. I'm Lucy. Nice to meet you. <laughs> so, okay, I get it now. 50 first dates. Where are you coming from? Breakfast? Yeah. How was it? I had waffles. They were delicious. I like making little houses out of waffles. You do? <laughs> She's like soulmate. <laughs> That's not fair, Adam Sandler. <laughs> Why is he closing off that road, though? <laughs> I'd be like, can you please move? Right there. I'm totally going to run over your big one. <laughs> Didn't work. <laughs> Get your pants. Oh, <laughs> no more penguin in the road trip. Yeah, keep the penguin out of it. No more. Okay, <laughs> Start beating me up. Make it look good. What? I'd be so embarrassed though if he was beating me up in front of you. Look at his outfit though. Making my sister clean your hotel room. <laughs> what does that have to do with this, really? <laughs> hey, hey, help me, please. Stop it, Howley. Are you okay? Yes, okay, yes. I'll be right back. Hey. <laughs> no, 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 no. Thank you, Dad. I'm sorry. Hey, what's wrong with you trying to bang your woman? <laughs> <laughs> he said, make my sister clean your hotel room. He learned his lesson. <laughs> What's your name? My name's Henry. You did good. Hi, I'm sorry. I'm in a community watch program. And <laughs> crazy bitch. Yeah, keep running. Okay, okay. He's. I'm going to have a stroke. <laughs> He's done tried it all. <laughs> Don't worry, I called the cops and I'm all set. Yeah, you all set for this, Mr. Smarty? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, well, when you're finished playing your little kidnap victim crap on my daughter, <laughs> come by the house. Okay. Yeah, that's that's when it gets a little out of line for me, though. That's when I have a problem. You're tying yourself up in the back of cars. <laughs> like you got an issue. <laughs> oh, boy. This is the man that gets off on the chase for real, don't he? <laughs> His outfit, though. <laughs> he looks like a WWE guy. <laughs> no. 
<laughs> Someday she's going to wake up and look in the mirror and notice her face has aged 10 years overnight. You know something, Henry? I worry about that every damn day of my life. Pardon me. Was this an icon? <laughs> I don't know. But I noticed we were both eating alone, and I thought perhaps I could sit with you, maybe build a syrup jacuzzi for your Waffle House. Oh, that would be nice, but I have a boyfriend, so I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name, then? Ringo. That was my dog's name. <laughs> his last name Star. Right, I'm sorry. No, this cop is writing me a ticket. Go on. Well, it's, um, expired May of this year. No, it expired May of next year. Officer, I think there's been a misunderstanding. It's October. Excuse me, can I borrow this? Look, October. Oh. Uh, Lucy, let's go back inside. Uh oh, I didn't think about that. Someday she probably figures it out. Have a bad day, Doug. Oh man. Hmm. Dang, so they have to do this all the time. I didn't even think about that aspect. She has to relive this trauma constantly. Mm. These are from the accident. I hate this because I know what happens. I'm still crying. <laughs> oh, no. I can feel it. You were in the hospital for three months, sweetheart. I have to talk to this doctor. I need to hear it from him. You have heard it, sweetie, many times. I have. Hmm. I'll take her. I uh, have to hear from myself, too. Dang it. Maybe that's one more person to help relieve the burden of that, though. Yeah, I think that's what they're kind of thinking, maybe. Hopefully they don't Doug, figure out about his past. <laughs> He's slept with a girl from every anymore. state at least five times. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be all right, Luce. Don't call me Luce. I barely know you. Sweetie, you're sort of dating him. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm not better looking. <laughs> <laughs> what else happened since last October? Did Alicia marry that guy? Yeah. Doug, did you win the Mr. Hawaii contest? I didn't know there was going to be a urine test. <laughs> <laughs> Do we have sex? Mm -mm, not at all. No, Never. we don't. Just so everybody knows that. <laughs> not you, man. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Hey, Lucy, good to see you again. What the hell's her problem? She doesn't remember who you are, bro. Oh, yeah. I suck at this job. <laughs> <laughs> he was the quarterback. Here, and, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 There, there he goes. Preparing your ability to convert short-term memory into long-term memory. The condition has come to be known as Goldfield syndrome. Uh, who's Goldfield? A brilliant Lithuanian psychiatrist. Uh, he himself suffered temporal lobe damage. It took him four years to publish his findings because he had to keep starting over from scratch. <laughs> <laughs> Magnificent amygdala as well. Doctor, so I have a question. This is a hygienic facility and shirts are required in the office. <laughs> that oh, doesn't dude, count. <laughs> a friend of mine's been experimenting a little with steroids. Mm -mm. And, uh, <laughs> he's been having a lot of wet dreams. Could there be a connection between those two? Douglas. Get off the juice. <laughs> Tell my friend he said so. <laughs> In any case, Lucy, your condition is stable, but most likely permanent. Oh, I'm so sorry. Dear. It could be worse. Yeah, how? Tom. Uh, hi, I'm Tom. Henry. Marlon. Doug. Oh, those are cool flip flops. Where'd you get them? You like those? Over in the North Door the other day. Hi, I'm I... Tom. Huh? Uh, Henry. Tom lost part of his brain in a hunting accident. His memory only lasts 10 seconds. What happened? Did I get shot in the brain? I... Hi, I'm Tom. Oh. That'd be so sad, man. I know. If that happens to me, just put me down, guys. <laughs> Don't you think you're a little old to still have wet dreams? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Tom. He didn't forget it fast enough. <laughs> good, night, good, night, good night, you guys. I'll see you tomorrow. I'll go. Well, when I get back, I'll let you know how it was. Oh. I guess I'll see you too. So maybe you could talk to me about Lily's. Lily? Oh, she's helping him. Oh, lover boy. Yes, sir. You learned yourself a couple of beers. Hey, let's go. <laughs> Hanging out with pops. So what are your plans when you finish your boat? Actually, I'm going on a trip in a little while to study undersea Pacific walrus behavior. <laughs> Sounds kind of fruity. <laughs> How long is it going to take? Uh, about a year. I guess you won't miss days like this. <laughs> well, maybe days like this don't have to be so bad. What are you trying to say? Well, when you guys tell her. Her life is basically a setup. I think that's what freaks her out the most. Well, you're an expert now? No, I'm just saying I wish there was another way besides, sorry we couldn't trick you today. Here's some pictures of your broken head. Oh, you want a broken head, huh, smart guy? <laughs> Why, are you going to give it to him? <laughs> I thought you was going to do it. <laughs> Nobody's got to break my head, guys. I'm going to split anyways. Oh, don't go just because my thumb is psychotic. <laughs> Good night. Sweet dreams. Keep them dry there, Doug. Very funny. 
My son is psychotic. <laughs> he said, keep them dry there, Doug. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Excuse me, Lucy Whitmore? Yes? I have a delivery for you. A delivery for me? Yes. Oh, they're beautiful. Mm. Who are they from? That I can't tell you. It's a secret admirer. He also wants you to have this. Who's your friend, Lucy? I mean, I don't know. We just met, but look. <laughs> I have a secret admirer. What's this? It's a videotape. A videotape of what? I have no idea. I have to find out. Oh, happy birthday, Daddy. Thank you, sweetie. <laughs> That's right. Happy birthday, sir. What are you, 200 today? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Tell what you're doing, Emma. I just wanted to try something different. If it doesn't work, we've only wasted one day, so. Wouldn't it be nice? This is scary. I know. I hope she takes it well. I'm Henry Roth. Um, I like you, and you like me, most days. <laughs> Aloha. Sorry about your brain. Oh. Uh, accident too. Believe it or not, this is my good eye. Whoa. My name is Henry, by the way. My name is Lucy. Smell my fingers? <laughs> Ooh, fish. Right on. <laughs> so, Lucy, I work at an aquarium. Aquariums make me super cool. <laughs> That's not funny. Don't rub those. I'm sorry, Mr. Whitmore, if you're watching. It's very late and my friend is a little unstable. <laughs> oh, come on. Stop with the licking. You make me sick. Lucy, I'm sorry. Anyways. Okay, so tell me a little bit more about yourself. Okay. What a chill spot. Well, I know. One over seven all-you-can-eat chicken wing contest. <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> then I'm a ballet dancer, but only in my bathroom. <laughs> what do you want to know? Do you love me? I didn't mean to put you on the spot or anything. I was just asking more for informational purposes as to keep the video up to date as possible. <laughs> sure. Probably more than anybody could love another person. How do I feel about you? You're excited about the chicken wing thing. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you've been dying to make out with me for quite some time now. He's actually been super patient with her. <laughs> he really has. <clears throat> Feeling better now? Nothing beats a first kiss. <laughs> <laughs> this is going like too good though. There needs to be some adversity at some point. So this is crazy. She gets to find someone who actually likes her and he gets to live out his little fantasy of being with someone different every day. Yeah, I guess so. Because <laughs> it's not about the different women around, it's just about like the chase of it, I think. Nothing Those new every day. first kiss. <laughs> That's what I've heard. <laughs> Pizza <laughs> what are you doing? Nothing. I was just getting some lint off for you. You're super feel ski. All right, I'm sorry, but this is like the 23rd time we've made out already. They're getting blue. <laughs> I, know. I know. I mean, I really don't know. <laughs> Why did I meet you one day before the accident? You say that all the time. You want to meet a friend of mine? <laughs> hey, Lucy, this is Jocko. Wow, thank you. Jocko, <laughs> what does a teapot do when the water is ready? <laughs> Very good. Hey, can I ask him a question? Go ahead. Jocko, <laughs> do you think that Henry and I are ready to take our relationship to the next level? <laughs> and do you think that I should bring him into the other room and take advantage of him? <laughs> I saw that hand gesture and I'm glad you did it. Really? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, look. Yeah. They're, uh, they're nodding in, in approval, I hope. Oh, yeah, no, they like you. Let me get them out of here. Mary Kate, Ashley, get a life. Thank you. Mary Kate, Ashley. Oh, they're very nice, though. Yeah, yes. That's a chill little spot, though. Is that his room? I think it's like uh, his office. Oh, okay. Maybe that's his house. I don't I was know. About to say, maybe he lives there. Oh, no. <laughs> 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 this reminds me of you this part because you be making up random songs. We liked each other right away, but you didn't remember me the very next day. <laughs> Forget Lucy's <laughs> got a nice capoose. <laughs> I used to do the dolphin. Car over so we could chat. 
Favorite time was when you beat the shit out of Ula with a bat. And we drove up to see Dr. Keats and found out why Doug always has to change his sheets. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who that is. I don't know. Some dude who cracked his head. <laughs> Probably a fighter or something. Even if while I'm singing this song, she's wishing I had Jocko with a walrus to show. Let's go. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Can't fall asleep. I'm not sleeping. That'd be so sad. Just closing my eyes. Could you be knocking out? Will you marry me? Of course. Don't forget about me. Never. So beautiful. They have a nice house, don't they? <laughs> okay, I know this is hard for you to understand right now, but we are actually seeing each other. We've been seeing each other for a while now. Oh, Lucy, Lucy, Lucy. If I wasn't telling the truth, how would I know this? That you're an art teacher. Stalker! No, no, no. Don't you remember me a little? <laughs> Was your head shaped like an egg before she hit you? Hey, don't make fun of Henry, all right? It's not his fault his head is shaped like that. <laughs> Doug, once again, off the juice. It's not juice. It's a protein thick. <laughs> so, Henry, the boys tell me you're setting sail for Alaska to study walruses. When does that adventure begin? All I know about walruses is that out of all mammals, they have the second largest penis. I have the first. <laughs> <laughs> Dad joke. Did you tell Lucy about this trip yet? <laughs> Well, I'm not going to tell because I decided not to go. I mean, Lucy needs me here. I know you think I'm crazy, but I think deep down inside, she's starting to remember who I am. No, Henry, that's what you want to believe, but it's never going to happen. Mm. Okay. Uh, will you tell her I'll be back later to pick her up? So you guys, don't tell anyone your sister beat me up. <laughs> tell you that kid could go to the moon and back and Lucy would never even know he left. Sometimes I wish my wife had Goldfield syndrome. <laughs> that way she wouldn't remember last night when I called her mother a loud, obnoxious drunk with a face like J. Edgar Hoover's ass. <laughs> Just spill the beans, right. brother. There's your medicine, little fella. Ula, get back to cleaning the pool. <laughs> and if that's one of your special brownies, don't let any of the dolphins eat that. How do you think I get the dolphins to do double flip and play with the white kids? <laughs> 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 okay, really, that's it. This time, try to stay clean for more than a day. I made you a nice anchovy Sunday. Okay, enjoy that. Henry, I was nervous because because I came here to break up with you. Whoa. You had plans and a life. Oh, she's just being dramatic. Before you met me, and now all you have time for is to make me fall in love with you every day. That's not all I do. I gave a penguin a bath today. <laughs> <laughs> plan is to erase you completely so it's as if you never existed. Dang. I have to make a new journal that doesn't have you in it. But before I do, I really want you to read what I wrote about you. I will read That's going to be tough tomorrow. for him. When you forget about all this breaking up stuff, OK? I'm not going to forget about it. I already wrote it down. I won't let myself. And I'm going to do it whether you want me to or not. So you're not erasing your life. Because if you wrote it down, then you're going to read it again, right? You see yeah. the contradiction? Oh, there's one about me. Reminder, he makes funny noises when I kiss his <laughs> neck. You sure you don't want me to put that in there? This man's a dang trooper for doing this, though. Mm -hmm. can skip that one. Oh, he reminds me of me reading. putting up with you. We made love tonight. It didn't last long, but it was <laughs> incredible. Oh, that's why he reminds you? <laughs> what? Not all about how long mm -mm. you know. It's, you know, there was a connection, I thought. I'm just playing. You know me. My name's Actually, Long Time Larry over here. <laughs> mm -mm. Well, that's that. Mm. Henry, wait! Could I have one last first kiss? It's a 2000s movie. They have to kiss in the rain. Ain't that what they did in Castaway? Yeah. <laughs> It was a 2000s movie. <laughs> I'm sorry I can't take you with me, but you've lived here so long, you're too big of a pansy to defend yourself in the wild. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel bad for you. I know you got a little romantic thing going on with Candace. 
<laughs> Candace and Bernice. <laughs> Candace, Bernice, and Rose. <laughs> yeah, I fell for one chick and I'm losing my mind. Good luck with that. Okay, baby. I love you. <laughs> Aww. Thanks, buddy. Remember to use a condom, or in your case, a hefty bag. Doesn't he look like Mushu in the face? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he does. I told you it was like a walrus all the time. <laughs> Bring me back a t-shirt. <laughs> oh, okay, he needs yeah. one. He hasn't worn a shirt all <laughs> okay. day. Love you guys. <laughs> My shirt size is medium husky. <laughs> That's very nice. Aww. Spam and Reese's. Aww. All right. I love Spam and Reese's. Can I have it? I guess. <laughs> 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 He's not going on a boat trip or anything. Teaching an art class for the others, and she gets to paint every day. Heck, she's even singing again. I got a little gift for you, too. It's just a little something from one sailor to another one. Mm. Why is she there? Your fisherman muscles. <laughs> <laughs> The Beach Boys? Oh, the Beach Boys. <laughs> what an asshole! What an asshole! Why you do this to me? She only sings from the day she meets you. She remembers me? Can we help you, sir? Yes, I have an appointment. What's your name? Um, Dude, he forgot his name. I feel bad for him. Just go on up, sir. Good luck with that memory problem. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> that guy sucks. <laughs> He's terrible at his job, bro. Lucy! Oh, no, no. Hey, yeah, I met you before. I'm Henry. Maybe you can help me out. I'm looking for Lucy Whitmore. Do you have any idea where I can find her? Hi, I'm Tom. Oh. Thanks, anyways. Lucy! Lucy Whitmore, can I ask you a question? <laughs> Do you have any idea who I am? No. <laughs> no? That sucks. <laughs> I want to show you something. Will you come with me? Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is my studio. Wow. Whoa. She's been painting him up, huh? Yeah, she be art thin and craft thin. She's really good at painting eggs. <laughs> <laughs> A Hawaiian shirt egg. That's so funny. They Henry. They just keep calling him an egghead, huh? But I dream about you almost every night. Why? You erased me from your memories because you thought you were holding me back from having a full and happy life. But you made a mistake. Being with you is the only way I could fool you. What? I'm just making sure you're not crying. You're the girl in my dreams. I already have like four times in this movie. <laughs> Hi, I'm Tom. <laughs> Henry, Lucy, nice to meet you, Tom. Now, why don't you come back in 10 seconds so we can meet again? <laughs> <laughs> Do you honestly take this woman to be a lawfully <laughs> wedded wife to have and to hold? I do. Really? Even though in like 10, 15 years, she could possibly let herself go and then like sex could be like <laughs> nauseating for you. Funny, that's your wife's right over there. <laughs> <laughs> I just kill him, Mumu. Man and wife. He calls her Mumu. Oh! oh. <laughs> Ooh. It's very cold outside, so when you're ready, put on a jacket and come have breakfast with me. Love very you. cold outside. Yeah. Oh, they finally went. Whoa, blows her mind. Where are they at? It ain't Hawaii. What a sight. <laughs> What's in a love? Hey, hey, good morning, Mrs. Roth. Would you like to meet your daughter? Let's we'll say hello to mommy. Hi, mommy. Dang, so she wakes up and meets her whole family every day. Grandpa's here. Hi, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that was good. Have you ever seen that, the animal? No. I, I don't know what that is either. Okay, guys, so that was 50 first dates. Babe, 
What do you think about that movie? Well, you already mm. know how I feel about it. I told you it's like one of my favorites. That was such a cute movie. I knew that this was one of your favorite movies, but we've been planning on watching this on the channel for a long time. When did you mention, I said it before, when did you mention this movie? Oh, we went to the aquarium a while back, and she mentioned that we were going to watch it a couple months ago, and you'd mentioned for a long time that we need to watch this movie. So I'm glad we finally got it done. This movie was so much cuter than I thought it would be. Yeah. I loved it, man. I mean, it was just cute, honestly. And I really liked it because I'm like an ocean head, right? Like, yeah. I love the ocean. So uh, we live in Georgia. So when we go vacation, our, we go south to Florida. So I just really like the vibes of it. I always thought Hawaii was one of the most amazing places in the world. So it was just an all-around feel-good movie. I see why you liked it so much. What's your favorite part? Um... Oh geez, that was a the funniest part to me was uh <laughs> just anytime what's his name? Is his name I know it's Sam, but I think they told me it was Sean o Sean Austin or something. Anyways, Sam from Lord of the Rings was honestly hilarious. He's, he says something, he's like, I'm gonna do like a underwater expedition to study Sounds the daily right. habits of walruses. He's like, Found fruity. <laughs> Found fruity. <laughs> Because he had a list part in it. Like, for what? I don't know. Because he did steroids or something. I don't know. He was freaking. <laughs> he honestly that might have been the best his best part. movie, yeah. <laughs> no, Lord of the Rings. No, was the best this. Movie. He was freaking funny in this. I thought he was the main character. But in this. isn't it funny his range, though? Because he can go from like, making you cry laughing, but <laughs> making you cry like for real. <laughs> <It> sounds pretty. <laughs> He was so funny, man. I thought when he was making his titties jump up and down, that John had me dead, bro. Because he wasn't bad at it. He kind of had a little bounce. I was like, that's not bad for Sam. I never would have right. thought. Um, funny. I like the dad, too. His just his cold attitude towards his son. That kind of reminds me of how my dad was towards me growing up. One time I got picked on about my eyebrows growing up a lot. You guys might can see, but they throw up the peace sign. Or at least they used to. And uh, I was, like, trying to fix it one day, and my dad was at the bottom of the stairs just Shaking his head so at me. So, that guy reminds me of my dad in a lot of ways. What's your favorite part, baby? I, I think my favorite part is just anytime they're at that <laughs> breakfast lounge. because uh, How is it so spot. short? Cause, Dang, that was a short movie. <laughs> yeah. But um, I guess anytime they're at that breakfast spot, because it's just so feel good to me. Like, I want to go eat breakfast there. It's, so, it's such like You're a, cute, a food head. You would yeah. do anything to go there. Yeah. So, it's like just a cute spot. Um, My favorite Hawaiian dish is Loco Moco. So, I feel like they would serve that at lunch. So, in your mind, <laughs> if you could go eat anywhere... That's like one of your fantasy places if yeah. it exists. Yeah, that's a nice little that's spot. A cool spot. And the thing that makes it so great is just in this movie, like the way they portray like Hawaiian culture and stuff. And I understand like Hawaii is a small island and there's a lot of tourism and stuff, but the locals who live there, it's a very small community. And mm -hmm. I think that's that's one of the things that's magical about Hawaii. I mean, I, I've never been there, but I could imagine that if I did get an opportunity to go there, I would really want to meet some of the local people and talk to people because I mean, Hawaii is amazing and all, but meeting those people would be pretty cool. It'd yeah. just be fun to meet people from that type of culture. It really right. Would. I, and the best pineapple I ever had was in Hawaii. So the fact that they had like a bunch, they had to go get one every day was so cute. Right. I bet they're so <laughs> fresh. I know. Uh, I thought the uh, the Russian girl, the Russian <laughs> dude was so funny, man. Yeah. I don't even know, man. And you said his name was Rob Schneider. Rob Snyder. That he guy's is Rob hilarious Snyder. in yeah. this. He kills this role. Right. He played in. Um, I think the hot chick. I want to say he was the main character. In the I hot never chick. saw the hot I chick. I remember Adam Sandler in the hot chick. That's I funny. saw I saw Deuce Bigelow European Gigolo when I was oh, a kid. Oh, I, I heard about that, but I never watched that one. And my so when I was growing up as a kid, for some reason that movie was considered like in in my mind, right? That movie to me was like a really edgy movie right. because he's like a gigolo. Or a I gigolo thought it was. I thought that movie and Borat were the same like type of movie. I don't, I, know. I don't know anything about Borat. I've never watched that either, but I've heard, you know, when I was growing up, it was like the edgy movie to watch. Well, I was able to watch that movie because it came on. Well, we used to have Channel 17, which was a local station. And I had like four or five channels growing up. <laughs> it was like 69, 17, 5, 2, maybe 11. And that movie played on it. <laughs> right. And that movie played on it. And uh, so I always thought the movie was so funny. But I haven't seen it in a really long time. I'd love to rewatch it one day with you. But uh, so I knew his name was Rob Snyder. I think he used to be an actor back then. I don't think he was. I know you guys were saying that a lot of the actors have like little cliches and stuff like people they vibe well with. And so Adam Sandler obviously has like his little click. Yeah. But I don't remember seeing... Uh, the Rob Snyder guy on The Longest Yard. The Longest Yard? I thought we watched Waterboy. Yeah, yeah, Waterboy. That's what right. it was, yeah. Which we do need to watch Longest Yard because I saw that on the Up Next. So we need to check that I've one out. I've seen that. I've seen that one. 
You like it. It's, I mean, it's a good movie. It's a funny movie. I think there's like a serious one and there's like a comedy one. I think one's Adam Sandler. I, I don't know. But um, if there's any more Adam Sandler movies that we need to see, let us know. Right. Recommend your favorite ones below. Um, this one, in, in my opinion, I think we've seen... I think Adam Sandler movies I've seen, if you count the hot chick, I've seen like three or four. But my favorite is this one. <laughs> right. Well, so far, so far. Usually, we'll like we watch Pulp Fiction and then everyone on Patreon is like, oh, we should get into Tarantino. And then, you know, when we watched The Longest Yard, everyone started recommending Adam Sandler. Yeah. So we're not trying to go on like an Adam Sandler kid. Waterboy. We did not watch The Longest Yard. Sorry, I keep calling it The Longest Yard. <laughs> well, it's because I've seen The Longest Yard and Waterboy was new and I only saw it that one time. So, right. In my mind, I just keep calling it that. But water sucks. But yeah, if there's any Adam Sandler movies, please let us know. Uh, we're we're definitely gonna watch more Adam Sandler because I think he's so funny. They make they make me smile so hard. For this some movie was such a feel good movie uh, yeah. though, and it wasn't as chick flicky as I thought it would be. I actually enjoyed it a lot more because my thing was like I've heard of this movie obviously, but I just assumed it was gonna be a really girly movie because right. of the main character in it. So I just never really had like Drew Barrymore. Yeah, I've never watched anything with her right. in it because I feel we like did, she's we watched Scream and she's in it. And which one? She's in the. She's the first girl that gets killed in Scream. Period. Oh, she's number the one. Who's cooking the popcorn with the short yeah. hair? Yeah. Okay. That's Casey. Well, I didn't even realize that when you said Scream Girl, I was like, I don't remember her. Yeah, she's the one. She basically she was like, so people will go. She was the clickbait for Scream. Maybe that's why she lost her memory. Maybe she got stabbed in the head. Right. I really like that movie, man. Baby, thank you so much for sharing that with me. That Aww, was so much thanks fun. Thanks for watching. Uh, I can't wait to watch yours too. So what you, we're watching? If you have good recommendation, like if if you like mine, then I know I'm gonna like yours. Don't say that because mm -hmm. me and you do not have the same interests when it comes to media. That is for sure. But for the you know we do we have a lot of crossover. But you only watch food. <laughs> well, and also like any movie that I've watched is probably like the girliest movie of all time. So like this and Mean Girls, they're two of my favorites. And the hot chick, like, come on, these are all girl movies. I want to see them all on this channel, but I know, like, if you look at the stats, not many girls are over here. So a lot of you guys are probably like, nah. <laughs> we'll watch anything. We'll watch anything. Right. Uh, but Mean Girls, that's my list. No, we're mean watch Girls, the hot chick, and of course, Fifty First Dates. Those are my. My three. sister had Mean Girls growing up. Oh but my god! I've never watched. Never watched that is my movie. That I used to quote my life off that movie until I kind of grew up a little bit. But. You you let me know Mean Girl quotes and scenes, and you describe little things from Mean Girls so much and. None of us ever convinced me. To right, watch I guess it more. Bring It On's my on my other list. So like Bring It On, Mean Girls, Hot Chick, and Fifty First Dates. Those are my four. I haven't seen Hot Chicks. Hot uh, chick, the Hot Chick. I know what Bring It On is because it was such like a cultural thing. I know T -t -t Torrance, you're Captain Torrance. Like I, I know that, <laughs> and then I know you got touched by Angel Girl. You got touched by Angel. I know that part because I had a sister, and I know the brother like is annoying but that's about all i know um because i think i saw that one but i don't really remember it because i was like four so those are my things because i i'm like a product of the 2000s like i was in my childhood in the 2000s early 2000s so all that stuff is my stuff like when i was like four my sister would babysit me well okay brother we're gonna watch uh bring it on and we're gonna drink lattes or whatever the heck we do <laughs> but she'd make me do all that stuff when i was like an infant barely um so yeah man Definitely saw uh, Bring It On. But, babe, I really like this movie. Thank you so much for showing it to me. I'm glad we watched it. I love watching comedy movies on this channel. I think the most fun, it's hard to say the most fun because I think the most fun I've had so far is watching Endgame and Game of Thrones. But I will say, um, other than that, I love comedy movies. They're so much fun. And, guys, if you're wondering if we're, like, on a substance because we get so many comments, no. We're <laughs> we just are genuinely, laughing. <laughs> we're genuinely just happy to be here. Uh I know that's a little odd sometimes. And sometimes when we're watching things that aren't that funny, we're a little flat. But, man, when we're, like, laughing and having fun, I'm the, I'm genuinely, like, the happiest person on earth. And a lot of that is because of you awesome people, for real. Uh, what we get to do is pretty incredible, man. We watch movies for a living. And it's we the edit best. them and we hang out with you guys. And it's it's genuinely, I don't even know how to describe it, man. The It's whatever, but what it does, it gives me a lot of freedom in our personal life. And it lets me hang out and meet and experience things with really awesome people like you guys. And... It's just so nice to put out a movie and get all the feedback and get to engage with you guys. And I'm always excited, no matter how many movies we put out, it always just feels so good to get something out right. that people want to see. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this one. I hope if you, you like this one, this. please, if you liked watching this, please like it because we don't get a lot. We need more likes on our I stuff. hate asking for like likes and stuff like that. But the reason we do it, man, is because people just forget. Like right. even myself, like, and I try to be really conscious of it. I always try to like the videos and stuff. And if there's people I watch, I definitely make sure I subscribe. But 
even myself, man, I forget to do it. And I understand how important it is for helping channels grow. So if right. you do want to see our channel grow, man, the best thing you can do is just come hang out with us when you feel like it and just like the video. And if you really want more Adam like. Sandler content, definitely like it because we, we kind of want to gauge what you guys want us to watch. And a lot will help if you like it. Well, I'll put it this way. So far with Adam Sandler, we're two for two. Yeah. We're two <laughs> absolute bangers. So Waterboy 50 first dates. Check. Like I said, some of his movies we I've seen personally, and some of them I'm sure you've seen, but he has a lot of movies, so I'm sure every movie the man's put out probably isn't one of the best movies of all time, but right. he has some iconic bangers, so there's a lot that I haven't seen, so we definitely need to get... And the, and the main reason, guys, I haven't seen him is because as a child, if I, I asked my dad for a movie, he would look at me like I was absolutely <laughs> insane, right? And I didn't really have access to anything like that, and then as I got older... Obviously, I didn't just go back and just think of every movie from my childhood I've never seen. But that's what we're doing now. Yeah, I so. think the first time I saw this was I got out in Blockbuster. I asked my mom and she was like, OK, right. then I was allowed to watch it because she watched it, too, and said it was OK. So she bought it for me. Well, my dad kind of hated TV growing up. It was something that and it wasn't that he hated TV. It was just that he was a workaholic. And if I was watching TV too much, he just thought that it was bad. So <laughs> um, he would watch a lot of TV after like working all day and stuff. But. It just wasn't something like, like, for example, I can only remember one time in my life we ever sat around as a family and watched a movie only once. And it was because our neighbors wanted to come over and watch it. And, uh, and it was, um, what's that movie called? Paranormal Activity, the very first Paranormal Activity movie. And I was in yeah, the living room. Yeah, I avoided I like, that completely. You know, Cause as you guys know, on this channel, I do not like scary movies. She is a rooster. Chicken. <laughs> Thank you so much for hanging out. Uh, we're going to stop blabbering, but we're going to go record some more stuff man because we got a lot more movies to watch so yeah, thank you guys have, for hanging out check we back. have house of the dragons to do and can't wait to get in that yeah if you guys are new here man we just got done with game of thrones we watched it live we're caught up on patreon this was a palate cleanser by the time this movie comes out man we might even be done on youtube but we're coming to the end we are coming to the end so if you haven't checked that out man please go watch game of thrones it really is one of the coolest things we've ever watched and we're super invested in it so i think personally it's our best content because we're just so into the show. Right. So. Uh, all right, guys. Peace.